Hello everyone and welcome back to Terraflops. It's Terraflops episode 3. Um, thanks to the last Terraflops episode game, uh, Hour of Victory being so bad that even the disc couldn't bear to be played, um, I've had to uh, quickly pick a brand new game from my pile of, sh of, of flops and this one is Silent Hill Downpour, a game which some people quite like some people think it's terrible, um, but basically it's so unremarkable that a lot of people have even forgotten that it exists. Um, and here is the uh, the intro to it, which is basically a really cheesy music video, which I'll probably get copyright claimed for, but um, I'm willing to risk it because uh, it gives you a good idea of the, the game's vibe. What is this place? What is this place? Yeah, so my first Terraflops game, Body Count, was a game that showed potential, but kind of failed in its execution. Didn't live up to that potential. Uh, Terraflops Episode 2 was a game that was more terrible than anything else. One of the most terrible games ever on the Xbox 360. And this is a very weird, bizarre, uh, it's an American take on Silent Hill. I think there's been a couple of American takes on Silent Hill. Uh, they've never been as successful as the Japanese versions. And um, yeah, I think I played... Well, we'll be able to find out how much I played when I look at the achievements, but I think I played a bit before just forgetting it existed. Hour of Victory was quite apt in terms of on-screen time, says Graham Young. It was. There you go, see, like, not all the heroes wear capes enjoy downpour. I still play it occasionally, they say. It's not the worst game you've played in the series. It is, however, arguably the worst game in the Silent Hill series, says Kate Lee. Lol. Hello to Offworld, Alex, uh, Alex Samaras, only Louise Outlist. Funny Pirates, Cluedo, Trey Green, Doug Wolf, EA, yeah, Winter 2, Governor Kirk, Six Gash, Sean, Richard Home, Graham Young, Hero Noda, Hockey Rupp, Kate Lady Games, and the Long Old Mark Russell, Media, Good Day, Nightcap, Metal Heroes, Red Cakes, Pink, Magpie, and Rainbow, Ross Terran, Ruthie Pinion, Spotify, and then Holy Muppet. This goes on for quite a while, I think. It might even be the whole song. Yeah, this is the new metalist of video games opening that I've ever heard. Why are you doing this to me? Some of that Silent Hill fog. Weird gas mask man. Oh, still going. Whoa! No, definitely doesn't look that way. Just we, point the way out of town. Are we done? I'll keep right on going. And I'll keep right on going. Okay, well here we go. Silent Hill Downpour. This is 2012. Konami Digital Entertainment. Let's check out the achievements that I've got for this. Oh, one achievement. Yeah, I really got bored of this quick, didn't I? Now you're cooking. Survive for Diner Otherworld. That was 2013 I got that achievement before I binned the rest of the game off. So, uh, yeah, it's been about seven years since I played this game. Feels like longer. Okay. <laughs> what an intro, says Lude Rabbit. It was indeed. Following up our victory with our long intro, says Longhorn. Nice. Hey, Carl Richardson. Okay, right, I'm not going to continue. I'm going to go into options. I'm going to make sure my inverted X axis is done. Yes, at least it remains. Remember that. I'm going to put subtitles on. Uh, I'll put object highlighting on. Um, oh, and you can also, the cool thing about this game is you can play it on 3D TVs, um, which um, it's just there frame packed stereo 3D, which I kind of wish. 
to a fixer, which I kind of wish I was doing right now. I haven't played a 3D game on my 3D TV since I ever, I don't think. Anyway, new game. Um, my monitor's always a bit darker than... My monitor's always a bit lighter than the stream. I'll go for that. Except all the text is so grainy and puzzle difficulty. Let's do easy puzzles as well. Yeah, this looks like a SD game, a standard definition game. The, the text and stuff is so fuzzy. What, why, why is it? Why is it not sharp? I don't understand. <clears throat> I don't understand. Uh, anyway, I'm ready. Come on. Show me some Silent Hill Downpour. I literally can't remember anything about this game. All I remember is it sank without a trace, like a tear in the rain. That X-Files font <laughs> says Nightcat. It was a very X-Files font. Here we go. Da -na -na -na. Ooh, that was about 10 frames per second in this cutscene. My stream might even be upscaling the frame rate so it looks a bit smoother. On my TV it's very juddery. Konami Digital Entertainment. I'm gonna sit back. It's he's a man. A prison man. Devin Shatsky. Oh Devin, I'm sorry. Alright, Murphy, it's all set. Make it quick, huh? Follow me. Follow me. Okay, move a little. Okay. Senior associate producer Tom Hull. At least the, uh, at least the graphics have become sharp now. Come on, Murphy, movies. stop screwing around. So, I don't have all day. No, it's like the subtitles are really like fuzzy, but the rest of the gameplay and those like name titles are. Uh, He's all yours clear. now. Make it quick, Cupcake. Make it quick, Cupcake. Hey, almost forgot. I left you a little present on the bench. Is it Sweeties? Have fun. Present on the bench, huh? There's no present here. Which bench? To interact with objects and doors, press A. Where's the bench? There ain't no bench. This is... You lied! The present was a, nothing. Maybe. Guess we're having a shower, are we? Hold on a minute. Oh. Yes. We're going to be doing some stab fighting. Turn on the showers, wow. Okay, so we've started off in quite a bad place. The prison guards are uh, obviously organising cellmate fights. Um, which uh, is probably going to teach me how to do the combat. The subtitle font is very manhunt. It's as off world it is. Okay, I look at me, clenched fist, relaxing in the zone, ready to do a murder here in Silent Hill Downpour. Shit. Oh my god! What the hell is going on? Someone painted Slimer from the Ghostbusters pink. There's been a mistake. Jesus. I'm a sequestered prisoner. You're not supposed to be here. What is it about this era and really gross facial models? You don't recognize me, do you? No. Nope. No, I. Guard! Guard! Anybody? Kind of like on his gut, it looks like he's got like a, an appendix scar. What? What? Oh, Open the goddamn door! Help somebody! 
Why? This is a violation of my this guy's done something do pretty bad. Probably to a member of our guy's family. Is help what me. I'm guessing. That's a guess. And now i just got to stab up this defenceless dude. Press X to attack. <laughs> Fucking hell. Yep, I'm just... Fucking hell. Cutting fuck out of... Toga McT Togary Terry. Pick up another weapon. Alright, fine. Well, a very challenging tutorial fight here. That's a whale on... I don't know. I'm gonna guess this guy is a bit of a child molester. Is what they're painting him out to be. I don't know why they'd give me the opportunity to wail on this dude so hard. Otherwise... He'd be like, what did you do to my kid? Or his wife. Or his dog. Dog Beats definitely deserves this. Why? You know exactly why. Wowzers. The blood splatter on the screen makes it immersive, says Pink Magpie. It really does. Hello. I like how the first fight was done in the shower room, and it's called Come Silent Hill Down. Down you know the drill. Very clever. This is a big day, huh? Tell you the truth, I'm sort of sorry to see you go. Oh, I get to leave now, do I? Prisoner secure. Open 302B. Transfer. Oh, so close to 32B. Da -na -na. I mean, compared to our victory, this is this is like. This is like a current gen game. Still not a hundred percent. Like your boy Leedman, Harry Leedman. His face, his face is all right, but all the NPCs have got like kind of Poundland face models. All right, let's go, go. Block B. Hello. Goodbye. I hope no one seagulls me in the face like that guy did to Agent Clarice Starling in Science of Arms. Was it seagulling? Or was it spider man It's one of the two. Whatever. I don't want to be on the receiving end of it. Thank you very much. Woo, indeed. I will indeed come back any time. Thank you very much for your hospitality, sir. Hello. Ha 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 ha. Excellent turnarounds. A little bit of hair physics as well on that guy. It was this floppy, floppy hair. A little bit of a blow in the breeze. This guy won't have any hair physics, I don't think, unless that Tash is animated in some way. This is it. No fond farewell? You gonna miss us? Love you, William Defoe. Willem, Willem Defoe. <laughs> Give it a couple of days at Wayside Max. I bet you'll start to oh. miss this place after all. I thought I was being let out of jail. Yeah, we sure are gonna miss you. Uh, but I am only merely being yeah. transferred a jail. Ah, fresh air. If only for a second. 
before I back in another jail. I've never done a jail. I'm pretty glad. I don't think I'd enjoy it in jail. Hello, Jail Officer Cunningham. Does this jail bus go straight through the town of Silent Hill? This doesn't look all that bad, really, says Lassus. No, oh, so far so good. Bit of a shocker on that uh, that now, guy's sir. face modelling that we Let's murdered. Let's get this done. Yeah. All right. See, so and that, and that guy's face. Mount up. <laughs> all right. Mm -hmm. This is fucking knockoff yeah, Grant yeah. Mitchell back there. Or Phil Mitchell, even. Pendleton. Yes. That's me. Harry Pendleton. Get on the bus. What? Thanks, jail officer Cunningham. And thanks to the small ten year old boy who's driving this bus. We got a long ride ahead of us. With the old man's voice. -na 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 -na. I know it's, it's like so in terms of live stream time Hour of Victory crashed and then it went straight onto this so it, like but it feels like a lifetime ago I was playing that piece of shit already it's just my brain is already blocking it out if you're watching this after a live stream on the Terraflops playlist it might be a different it already seems like, uh, I mean, cutscenes wise, it's way better than the body count as well. Body count's cutscenes were severely lacking in story, character, plot, and cutscenes. <laughs> Hour of Victory's cutscenes, I could have been, it'd been better with stick men. What? Cunning, why so angry? Cunningham's got huts for your boy Pendleton there. Never thought I'd see him play Silent Hill games as my reason. Played a bunch of Silent Hill games. I even did one for a late to the party with Johnny. Do you have a good nap, Wordle? I did, thank you, Gretel. Puta, puta that is rude. You. I don't know about Gretel, but Puta Shut the hell up! Fuck you, Guero. I said, yeah, God, I might be it. Oh, no. Here we go. Smashy, crashy. Ooh, it, did it land on a train track? Is it going to be like a, the start of The Fugitive? I hope so. Fugitive. That's a movie I've not seen in a very long time. But I really want to watch now. Come to think of it now. See you later, Ross Taran. It's got to go brave Tesco. Oh, God. Stay safe. Don't breathe in anyone else's air. Well. We are now on the floor. Some passable water. Nice kind of woodland texture. It's all good. You know, I ain't no digital foundry, but this isn't too bad. Okay. Oh, think. although. Find the highway. Put some ground between no. yourself and the bus. No, now my face has lost all detail for some reason. In the prison, I don't know, I didn't really look at my face in the prison, but this face looks really fuzzy out here. Ah! See that bird? I didn't, I wasn't looking up, up there, do you think? Is there a run button? That's a, do we go that way? 
I guess we came down that way. I'm gonna to I'm gonna think we go this way because this looks like a press blur to crouch. Oh no, no, it just does it automatically. Hello. Okay. Hello. Didn't even have to blur. I can hear you. I should turn you up a little bit. So many crows. Stone the crows. It's a little bit foggy, as the Silent Hills are meant to be. Oh shit. Ah, oh, no. Press left or right to balance on narrow beams. Ah, oh, fuck. This is crazy. Yeah. That's oh, annoying as well. I hate these things. Because you just tend to be, if you fall off, you have to start right again from the very beginning, and it's just like, ugh. How long do I have to do this for? It's always because you're edging along, it always takes a long time as well. There's no way I'd have done that in real life. I'd have been like, get fucked. Wow! Still a tree. Whoa, that's a long way down. Okay. Uh, oh. I hope this isn't one of those games Not where you can climb enough. in cutscenes, but you can't climb in the Get game. Get your ass down on the ground now. Hi, Cunningham. Hands where I can see him. Do it. Take it easy. I'm not going anywhere. I said, on the ground now. Okay. Such a job's worth cunning Cunningham. He's not on the ground. I was just looking for help. And you just I... happened to lose your cuffs in the process? Save the bullshit. Yeah, how did he lose his cuffs? <laughs> this is stupid. I'll meet you back down at the bus, okay? You're gonna get yourself killed. Shut up. <laughs> Shut Keep your goddamn hands where I can see them. Shut up. Ah! Oh, unlucky. Oh, you screwed now. Oh. Oh my god, I can. Oh, I'm gonna help her because I'm kind. Hang but on. I'm slipping. It's funny Look that you can leave her. Oh no! Oh, well, at least my conscience is clear. I tried to help. Damn it. I would not be taking... I would not be risking that to catch a prisoner. Jesus, Hero Nader. No, me neither. Um, okay, well... Um, uh, Cun Cunningham died, and it seems like... Unless I can actually climb this... It seems like the only way to advance is to go the exact way that just killed Cunningham. If only I'd move faster. No. Nope. No, nope, can't go that way either. So what then? Maybe I can climb this? Oh yeah, here we go. It's just there's no prompt. Also the other part there's small like not as high, surely. Oh well, don't matter. Don't matter, don't matter. That was not Hunnigan, Lassus. That was Cunningham. Hunnigan was far more, far more respectable. Uh, okay, is there a run? No, that's a that's the opposite of run. That's a turtle down. That's punch. Jesus. Oh, there we go. There it is. Okay, so there's the classic Silent Hill fog drop. So I guess we're going this way. Into town. Oh, there we go. Could have told me that earlier when I was bloody looking for it. Gas. I have, yes. Um, okay, what we've got here? A torch. Oh, that'll come in useful. A, pick up. Picked up a flashlight. Press L button to switch the flashlight on and off. Press B to clip it to you. Okay, it's pretty... Clipped it to my belt. Okay, it's pretty light at the moment. Pick up. So what is it? 
I've picked up a book. Find a way out of the area. Get back to the highway. And then this is my map. I can't... Oh, I can zoom in and out. So I'm by the gas station. There's the diner. So I've got an achievement for doing the diner. So I've definitely done that. The radio's in Silent Hills. When they go like that, it means there's monsters around. I've got myself a blunt weapon now. And I want to check out this sign here. Have you seen this dog? Lost on Tuesday, 12th July. Response to the name Carl. Any information leading to me to the finding of my dog will be forwarded, will be rewarded with $500. Cool day or night. That looks like a pretty angry dog, Carl does. Okay. Can I use my thing to... Oh, okay, yeah. Smashy, smashy, smashy. There we go. Not too bad. Sweet, you've got a clobber act. I do. It's Spoopy McFoggington, says Gaz Sharp. Hold aim, press LT. RT to throw. Okay, so I can throw my blunt weapon which is good that is not a dog name says Ruthie Pinion it isn't really is it burbs what else we got here anything useful uh, not, there's anything collectible around here so to the ladder break in eat all the scotch eggs wait for death says nightcap that sounds like a fucking great plan to me if this, if the world was the Walking Dead, I'd want Nightcat to be our uh, our crew leader. With with the, with plans like that, how could it possibly backfire? It's a boomerang wrench, is on Holy Muppet. Sure is. What's this here? Turn. Okay, I've got it. Okay. Was there anything else in here? I mean, that's quite a that's quite a drop here. Uh, that's so that's the way out back to the pump, petrol pumps. Yeah. So let's head this way. Auto crouch. Ooh. Devil's pit. I can't remember. I remember this. Just a little glimpse of this. That devil's pit sign in the, f the building in the fog is as much as I remember. Devil's pit aerial tram. What's the betting we've got to start the tram up? Starting up an aerial tram car is so video game. It's unbelievable. In fact, if that if Hour of Victory had actually bothered loading, uh, you would have seen that... Um, there was an aerial tram car in that as well. There we go. So there is some... Look, what is that? It's almost like something has been dragged. Hello. Free tram ticket. Free tram ticket. I swear the hell's a machine. Someone's nicked the ticket machine, huh? I'm tough. I'm sorry, but Power's out. why the? F Honestly, why the fuck would you need a train ticket? <laughs> game tokens look ancient. Game tokens. That's ridiculous. Why on earth? Why? 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 Who's here? Where's the ticket? Where's the man to collect the ticket stubs? Are you telling me that there's a like a, a machine in here that detects your tickets and it'll only run if you've got a ticket in there? Why is that turning when I don't even have a ticket? Huh? I guess it I guess I have to get through the turnstile with the ticket, but This must be the ticket machine. Yeah. Okay. So I need a ticket to turn that door. Fine. So to turn that door, I need to find the ticket machine. 
He doesn't want to break the law anymore, Ian, says Spudfella. I mean, okay, that's fair enough, Spudfella. You do have a good point. Our guy has turned over a new leaf. He's no longer a criminal. He tried to save a life. What's that? A pickup. Just a... What is that? Is that just a rock? Here! I don't know if this plank of wood's going to be any better as a weapon than my wrench. To be fair, a bit more reach, but... Probably not as... Good. Looks like it opens from the other side. Oh, of course it does. Of course it does. Oh, barbed wire as well. Not much climbing going on there. That's that rock I threw a minute ago. Is this the diner? Are we here at the diner already? How do I bring up my inventory? Oh, oh is it that one? Right trigger maps. Oh yeah, I'm at the diner already, but so I guess I never learned how to turn on the uh, the cable car, the tram car. Whoop! Ooh, spooky! Everyone's talking about Scotch eggs. Scotch eggs are pretty nice, but um, it has to be homemade Scotch eggs. I'm not a big fan of motorway no. Scotch eggs because they always What's just that? taste so packaged in and chemically. No, fifty-two. Orange fifty-two. No doubt about it. He's talking like Homer. Oh, Flathead fifty-eight. Oh, no doubt about it. Oh, oh. Wicked old beast, ain't she? What? What? <laughs> I said she's a wicked old beast. Me, I'm partial to something with a little less rust. But to each his own. Lots of people out here expecting letters, are they, mate? I don't want any trouble. Just point the way out of town. And I'll keep right on going. Now, who said anything about trouble? Just trying to be helpful, son. Mm -hmm. Name's Howard, by the way. Thanks, Haunted Howard, Murphy. who is definitely not haunted. Murphy. Heading to prison. He's got two. Who is he? Murphy Pendleton. He's got two. Uh, just two looking for a way out of town. Is, is all. That's so. Afraid all the roads are out, every last one of them. Well, strangest thing. Bum. Hey, Stroyer. What the? F <laughs> Something wrong, son. England is where cuisine goes see? to die. You're right, Stroyer. That's why we have so many takeaways. Because hmm? everyone else's national cuisines are way nicer. Never mind. Fish and chips is, is nice. If you're really desperate, you could try the old Sky Tram. Of course, it hasn't really been kept up since the accident. I mean, it seemed to be working fine. All I needed was a ticket. That's the spirit. Okay. Well, this mail ain't going to deliver itself. Good luck, Murphy. Thanks. Hope you find whatever it is you're looking for. Yes, it's the way out of town. You didn't help me at all, dickhead. Hey, what's the name of this place? I... Whoa! Change into new clothes. That's an that's an odd objective to just suddenly turn up, surely. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll try and find myself some new some new togs. Can I scritch through here. Yeah, I can scritch through here. Proper fish and chips from a proper chip, fish and chip shop. Real nice. I don't have it very often, but... Uh, if, you're ever, if you've never been to the UK before... Can I not smash this pad... Oh, shit. Uh, oh, no, I can't get through the tree. It's not a next-gen bush. It's previous-gen bush, so we can't go in it. Ah, oh, fuck, I've got no weapons now. Yeah, if you've never been to the UK before... Um, but you ever come here you to visit? You can't you've already done. But you can't face up to it. Thanks, voice and head. Man. <sighs> Gotta try for what? Hit my head. It's it's damn hard to crash. What I'm trying to say is, if you come here, go to a proper fish and chip shop and get a big cod and chips. A nice big large cod and chips. Gravy, salt and vinegar, the works. It's a good dish. Okay, so... Yeah. 
Can I use the wrench to smash this door open now? No, I just threw my wrench again. Where did my wrench... The, did my wrench go? Shit. Alright, maybe there's another way. Oh, the wrench is back. What the? It is a boomerang wrench. Okay, so... I don't know. This doesn't seem to be openable. So do I need to find a key from somewhere to get? Because that's... That's definitely saying not locked. And I'm... No. Why does he th throw it when I... I don't even press the left trigger. If you swing it like three times, he just starts... Oh, fuck! Mate, what's wrong with you? No, it's gone, oh, it's gone behind the bloody bush again as well. Hmm, so I guess I need to find a key from somewhere. Now I've thrown my weapons, all of my weapons away. There's no way in through that door. I thought maybe that would open. This this wrench is back again. Maybe I have to use this wrench for something that's not the door. Maybe I have to use the wrench for something to do with the car. They did draw a lot of attention to the car. Let's see if I can just smash a window and get in that way. Can that? No. Power cable says no. Can't go through that. Can't move through that tree. That was a stone. Uh, oh, uh, the what the fuck? The oh, the game's just having a seizure. Sorts. Um, okay, why was it doing that then? Oh, okay, I'm I'm stuck already. Maybe there's something on the porch. No, nothing on the porch. That's just like danger of death. Keep off. Okay. Don't have to tell me twice. Can I get through this door? No. I feel like there's something I'm missing back here. But what it is, I don't really know. I can't get through that. A unlock. Can't lift that up. There's nothing under there. Anything in the bin? I now have I now have multiple wrenches. Um. Well, I don't fucking know. I'm absolutely stumped. I don't see any keys or anything lying around. Might have to Google a walkthrough. through my wrench again. Right, that's it. Googling a walkthrough. Can't be asked. Let's try and work this out. So, now down poor. Get into diner. What? Head inside. 
gas station. Blah, blah, blah. Between the up barrels, you can go through the fence. Go ahead, turn the corner. Yeah, you have to bust open the lock with your weapon. So why the fuck is it not working? I think I I also think I might need to use the ramrod and then the shotgun. <laughs> Space I forgot to. Why just why does he throw it after the third swing he always throws it That's so fucking annoying and stupid why would I want why on earth would you want your character to throw away a melee weapon on him, on his own What the fuck is going on I threw it again fucking hell Objective, change clothes. Go to the very right of the diner, between some barrels, and you can go through the fence. Done that. Go ahead and turn the corner, and bust open the lock with your weapon. Which is this lock. Is there some other weapon I need? Has anyone out there... Pick up the map on the bench outside and then keep going left to find a wrench. You can use the, it to bust open the door next to where you found the map. Pick up the map on the bench outside. I did that, right? Unless there's another map. I'm attacking by pressing X. I think. Let's try. Okay, let's try it with a stone. Oh, I've thrown this a bloody thrown the stone. Where's the stone gone? Uh, maybe it's time to jump off the cliff with the mailman's has spun off seat. I think it might be. Alright, I think Fuck off, don't punch the bin. So I think I may... So you hit with X. But you also hit with right trigger. And maybe I was pressing right trigger and not X. Why would that make a difference? <laughs> That's... Oh, fuck. I don't know whether to be angry with myself or the game then. So what I was doing was hitting with the right trigger... Which is why sometimes he's he's also throwing it as well. But you're basically, I don't know. Why would you have? Mm. Hello. Hello. Never Over mind. Here. Let's move. Let's move past that before I lose my temper. It's hot in here. <laughs> Pie, apple, blueberry, rhubarb, banana split, devil's pit Sunday. Mm. Okay. Well, we've got lots of. Lots of melee weapons. And a money. I picked up a money. Yay. So glad I'm inside now. Okay, what's that? Pick up. Early residents of Devil's Pit. Did you know the Native Americans used to call Silent Hill home? Anthropologists know this because of the various artefacts found here, specifically in the cave systems surrounding Devil's Pit. 
Hey kids, is Silent Hill a special place to you? If you were naming it. If you were naming this area, what would you call it? Shits, Shitsville Spookatron. Alright, well. Can I. Game tokens. Okay, what about. Let's play some mu music. Yeah. Uh, spooky, spooky, Silent Hill. The scariest things are the controls. Hello. Use the toilet. Oh, flashes, nice. Okay. I kind of like the way that the doors are, um, they're kind of like peekaboo fear doors. You could be like, uh, 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 uh. There's got to be something hidden in the toilet, right? I didn't look in the other one when I flushed it. Please. Wow, that toilet bowl fills up quickly, doesn't it? Oops. Just gone in for a pup. Uh, nothing else in there. Wait, what is that? Is that a key? No. Wasn't a key. Just going to double check in this toilet. Fuck off! What the hell, camera? Oh, Jesus. I'm just going to... Okay. I thought it was going to do the Resident Evil thing of having like something hidden in the toilet. I'm looking for a change of clothes at the moment. I don't know why anyone would keep a change of clothes in a toilet. Or why Murphy Pendleton here would want to wear toilet clothes. But I'm starting to remember why I... Yes. Oh. I'm starting to remember why I probably gave up on this game. It's because it was frustrating. Okay, gas. I remember this uh, room as well. I think we go into um, into the Silent Hill zone soon, and it gets a bit. I seem to remember we go into the Silent Hill zone soon. It gets pretty creepy. Go down some like kind of big old stairs or something. It gets all barbed wirey in Silent Hilly. Um, what is this here? Hold on. What? Why did you get... There we go. Oh. Unlock. Is that a door? That's not a door. So what's that? That's a pressure gauge. It doesn't do anything. That's a... Oh, fucking hell yeah. Butt pans. Definitely going to batter people with butt pans. Okay. I'm running out of places to look for clothes now. Pick up. There's the Devil's Pit Stop map. Um, there's two floors to this place. Crazy. Um, everything is locked. What? Well, Doors closed. Uh. Okay, well, you're not a thing. I can't go through you. Have I tried this door yet? I've tried that door. I've tried that door. Turn the gas off. It's probably kind of dangerous. Probably one of the first things I whoop should have done. Nards. Oh, Nards. Oh, Nards. Ah. Uh, uh, hi. Um, fire alarm. Smash. Lop. There we go. Thanks. Another downfall. Excellent. Wait a minute. That fire alarm sounds weird. Oh, she. What the hell? What? What? what the hell is this? That was kind of cool. And now we're in creepy Silent Hillsville. Shit. Did the water reach that breaker box? Oh. Okay. Well, let's try and turn the water off then. This can't be happening. Oh, I'm gonna rotate again. Oh. Oh. What an incredibly powerful jet of liquid. 
Who's he shouting fire for? Says Drad Wolfie. <laughs> yeah, totally. Can't stop the V, says Toasty. Oh, here's the stairs, I remember. Yep, this is definitely a Silent Hill game now. A frustrating as fuck one. But it's definitely gone Silent Hill. Oh, my word. Can I still look at the map? I can, but it's not really showing that I'm here anymore. I guess, yeah, I gotta guess that maps don't really work in this place now that there's sofas on the ceiling. Good job I got my saucepan to protect me from the tar vomiting tubes. Hello, it's me, fixed camera angle. Son, glad that's just suddenly become a thing. Rotate. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. What? What are you? What are you? Can I... So I can probably run through that door. But what the f is the weird bed thing going on? I have no idea. Hello. Oh. Oh. Ah. Hey. What? 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 what did... Run! Okay, we gotta run. It turns out there's a miniature. Whoa, fucking hell! Miniature. Oh god. A miniature black hole. To look back, press and hold LB. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to look backwards. Press A to knock over obstacles and slow down pursuing monsters. I forgot to knock anything over. Okay. Um, multiple routes, not fun of that. Ah, shit! Ah, shit! Tuh! Ah, indeed. Oh, Murphy! No, it's not the time to run in cool slow motion. Yep, still being chased by a big fart. Hey, to dick! Did I run it? Oh, okay. I outrun it. Oh. Ooh, this looks fun. Whee! Scoo! Oh, no. Oh, my God! Who would build that? Ooh! Oh, fuck. Whoa! Oh, fuck. Whoa! Oh, fuck. Why? <laughs> what? What's happening? Hi. Hi, it is I, Murphy Pendleton. Champion butt sledder. What is this place? Uh we're in um we're in an MC Escher hellscape. So we've got splashy, splashy water. Um, and what's that bridge there? Nothing to do, nothing to do, nothing to do. We're going up these stairs then. There's a, some kind of button up here. Oh, that's a Turnatron. Just what I wanted, a new room. Rotate. Is this going to rotate the world? 
What the? The whole... Okay. That's not how water works, but... I'm going to... I'm going to go with it for now, because... Not really much else I can do. Wing B. This is... Okay. We... Getting a bit prisony metaphor here. Well, not even metaphor. It's just big cells. Can I get into that? Nope. How about down here? What lovely song they're playing. Born free, free with my soul's pan. I think I threw it. Fuck! I threw my saucepan. Shit. Oh, there goes. Thanks to my shit joke, I am now without a means of defending myself. What else is moving? Oh, back here. A door is opened. Hello. Oh, it's like one of those cool wallpaper things you can get in Animal Crossing. The animated wallpapers. Ooh. I mean, fair play to the developers of this game. They shit. They did some pretty cool stuff with the, the scenery. Oh, fucking slow mo. <laughs> <laughs> I love that he's... I actually... I quite love the fact that he's crapping his pants. You don't, you don't get many um, protagonists in video games that are... You know, that will shit themselves so... Vocally. Is this the right way? I don't know. Probably not. Is that going to open now? Is it open now? Yeah, it's open now. Okay, let's go. go. Let's go, let's go, go, go. That's still chasing me. Let's get up these bloody stairs. Oh, it's... Okay, I think... Can't change the camera angle, but I don't think I'm being chased by anything anymore. If only you had a pants, this guy's shot. It's true. I guess you could say he's pan free, says Longhorn. Hi -o. Nice. Nice. Pan free. Hold on a minute. What if I go back down again? Oh, no, I'm stuck on that fucking never ending staircase. Where's my torch? Is there actually going to be a way up? Am I supposed to go back again? Sometimes you play a game like this and it's like, yeah, run forever one way. But then you you actually turn around and run back down the other way. But at this point I'm a bit scared to turn around again. I'm going, I'm gone far too, all right, fine. Fuck you, I'm going to run back down again. Maybe it'll change. Oh yeah, oh there we go. Ah, phew. It was one of those games where that thing happens. Hello? Ah! I'm back. Hello? I'm on my mind. I think yes. I think maybe you are, sir. Door's still locked. It's not on fire. That's fine. That can, I can open this now. Hello! It is I. How did I... How Torch do? Oh, there we go. Here's I. Arthur McTorch do. Uh, oh. So we're back in the... The real world now. Less scary. More bookie. Nothing there. What's this pickup? Oh, a chair. 
Well, is there nothing else in here? Okay, I'm going to take this chair with me. I'll go through here. Hello? Spooky toilets. There's some health there, first aid kit. This is quite a big diner. There's a lot to this diner. It's like it's got the person who lives in its house attached to it. It's a bit like the um it's given me the uh, the feeling of a Resident Evil 7 police state uh, Resident Evil police station where there's just like you have a building and then just it starts getting nonsensical and nothing like the actual building that it should be in the first place. Oh, great. I'm in an abandoned... No, I don't want that. I want it's the first aid kit. I'm in an abandoned building that's full of grim memory scares. And... What's that? That's a bit of wood. No, I want my pan. Pan's better. Pan is better. Uh, okay, I can't get the pan. No, you. So I. You've let. Oh, there we go. Fucking hell. Uh, yeah. This is basically not a good place to be, is it? Working gruels. I am getting some flashes of memory from this area as well. I think I found. I think I've. Ooh, knife. I feel like I found this game far too frustrating and just couldn't be asked with it. Like a way out. Looks like a way out. Doesn't look like it's working though, does it? Panels busted. Panels busted. Hmm, that's what I said. Okay. Right. So I need to find a new panel. How do I get through there? Oh, hello. Oh, oh, no, the game occasionally just has a little snooze suddenly remembers that it's meant to be doing stuff and then speeds up again. Like that. Uh, nothing in spooky closets. So let's head down here. Put on the spooky shelves. It's a wrench. Right, I'm going to press the right button this time. Right. <coughs> Okay. Wait. Okay, well I was pressing X, but maybe knives... Just like in real life, knives aren't very good at breaking padlocks. There we go. Okay. Excellent. Give me the knife. Even better. Hello. Vice. Um, weird cell door. I'm gonna go in here. Looks like someone's been here recently. Is it? TV's on. Turn it off. It's giving me the creeps. Uh, I've picked up a. What is this? Room five B. Return to room. Showered. Shampooed hair. Times two. In bed. With plant, uh, no panties. Lights off 9:30. Cheats in Vandal. Order room service. War oversized men's button up. Shaved legs. Old uncle cried himself to sleep. This is a peep in Tom's diary, isn't it? Someone in this hotel's been perving. It's a diner plus hotel, I think. And someone has been. Being a big old fucking creep show. Piece of wire. Here we go. This will help me with the lift, I'm sure. Well, hopefully, I can get out of this pervert's paradise quickly. Oh, oh. Because. Oh, no, shit. Something's happening. Oh. 
Oh my god. Come on, bitch, let's see what you fucking got. What the? Oh. I see. It's time to get some payback, criminal douche. Is he punch? Is he beating up Cunningham? Do you reckon? Oh fuck! No, he wasn't beating up Cunningham at all. Oh. Oh no. I have made a terrible mistake. Press the hold Y to block. Okay. Oh, well that didn't work. Hey. Oh no, I... I thought he was being a criminal badsman. I judged him... I, I judged the book by its cover. I saw him in his criminal outfit and I believed he was doing a bad. But in fact, he was just protecting himself. Sorry! I feel I felt guilty for a second. It's okay. It's past. Okay, which way was it? To the left. It's this way. Here we go. Okay, I want to use the piece of wire. What a twist indeed, Jacob M. What a twist indeed. Okay, we're two frame rates per second our way up. We go. No. I'm outside. Ray, for sure. Back outside. What about, oh, I've got outside. This is probably where I was like, never again. Maybe something bad happens here. It stopped me. I was like, nah, fuck this game. Do I want to go back inside again? Seems unwise. Especially seeing as all the lights are off in here. What's that? Uh, uh, oh, fucking hell. Hello. Nah. What's this room for? Even, not even any storage items in there. It's just... Okay, well this is... Must be one of the motel rooms. Your actions, or lack thereof, have killed three people already. Four if you count that mailman walking off the edge, destroyer. Listen, it's not murder if you didn't technically do anything. It's just laziness. <laughs> just laziness. And of that, Your Honour, guilty is charged. What's that? A shovel. What's this here? Is there a note there? No, I'm going to open this door and have a look inside. Hello! Oh, wow. Lacking the home comforts in this one, don't you think? Good lord. It's nasty. Oh, look! Is this the... Jailbreak, one token. I guess that's what I need the tickets for then. Are uh, the game coins for? So I need to ye olde video game follow the cables thing. I get you. Oh, of course they're hidden in the undergrowth. God, performance in this game is pretty shocking at times. Okay, rotating again. Okay, that's quite an easy generator to turn on. Let's take a look at the view, shall we? Hope this doesn't do like a horrible collapsing. Oh, very high up. All I see is clouds. Is there anything cool down there? No. I was looking for collectibles. Don't think there are any in this game either. Okay. So I've turned on the generator. So I'm going to go in here. And I'm going to go to here. 
and I'm going to use a game token and I'm going to press start oh do I have to what do I have to do control the ball so it doesn't go in the holes or so it does go in the holes I'll try it in a hole not sure that works Why are those ones flashing? If I, what if I do that? Hmm. Okay, I definitely, I don't think I need to go that way, and I'm not sure I need to do it in a in the butt. How about that? There we go. That one's stuck. Okay. Oh, red, green, green. Oh, okay. I get ya, I get ya, I get ya. So this one goes here. Okay, and then this one. This is a really stupid mini game. I wonder if this would have been difficult if I hadn't selected easy puzzles, I guess there would have been more holes yes. around. Yes, I got sky train. The free ticket to get onto that sky train. That's, what a fucking roundabout way to get a, a ticket for a bloody sky train that might not even work, eh? Alright. Well, that way was a, that way is a dead end. So we'll go in these buildings first and check out these apartment rooms open <laughs> didn't realise you could open things booze bottles nothing I'm actually kind of getting into this um, I don't think it's brilliant at the moment by any means necessary. Its performance is terrible. Um, there's a lot of screen tearing and juddering and puzzles are a bit weird and like it kind of seems a bit pointless. But uh, yeah, it's not as it's not as terrible as I remember it being. As I was, it's not as terrible as I remember thinking it was or I don't, that's the thing though. Do I did I think it was terrible? I must have thought it was bad to stop playing it. Especially at such an early point in the game, but maybe I just couldn't be fucked. I need to work out how to get out of here. I think maybe I just found it frustrating and couldn't be asked to work out the puzzles. There's no way to get past that. But it's like it seems alright. It's definitely um it's no hour of victory, let's put it that way. There is a padlock over there. But I, can I? Oh, yeah, here we go. I wonder if that way was blocked off bef what the, before open inventory. Wait, why, would, why does it want me to open the, my inventory? Is there a... I guess, I guess I've missed a key? Maybe you were too scared, says Mark Russell. Uh, I mean, this, potentially. This game doesn't seem very scary, though. What's that? A rake. I'm wondering whether I've missed a key somewhere. Uh... Seems to be one around here. Maybe there's, a, maybe there's a key in one of these, like little hotel rooms. Probably not in this one though. But have a quick, quick zhuzh around. I don't think it seems key here. 
I think maybe in it'll be in a draw uh, in one of these hotel rooms that I haven't searched properly. There's nothing in can't go through any of those doors. So let's try this one. Oh, is it really a is it really a coin slot? Or is is that a, a is, ooh that was a meat cleaver. I mean I wouldn't put it past it being a weird coin operated hold on a second. Can I go in that? No. Yeah, I wouldn't put it past being a weird coin operated lock. No, it's nothing there. What in there? I'll go back and check. That's got to be the dumbest thing ever. No, okay. There is not a coin slot. I was going to be like, I was going to say that seems a bit ridiculous, even for this game. Having a, like, how would that even make sense? Like, even though this is the Silent Hill world, how would having a coin-operated gate at the back of a hotel complex make any sense? Okay, I don't think I've been in this one. This game badly needs V-Sync, someone said. Who was it? Mike Burgess. It does a bit, doesn't it? It's very screen teary. I think I might find the key in here. It's a bit better lit. I've already been in here, is that why? I think I've already been in here. Is that why things are open already? Oh, I was hoping to find a key in here, but... Wait, what's that? That's a pack of, pack of cigarettes. It's a packet of cigarettes! Alright. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm doing a walkthrough again. I'm looking at the walkthrough again. I can't be fucked. Uh, motel. Real world. Uh, back in the kitchen. Normal. Move through first room. Okay, so. What? This, what? Start the fire, other world, doopy doo. Run the path, back in the kitchen. Remember the door is locked, or no, you can go through it. There's nothing through the door to left except the chest used as a weapon. You can find one of those off, right? First path. Move through the first room into the second and grab the key on the table in the kitchen. Go back to the stairs in the previous area and ascend them. There's a key at the top of the locked door. Head through the door immediately to right. Move into the room, then right, then bed, open the middle for a power cord. What? Seems to be giving me completely different walkthrough. Places I've never been to. What? I'm so confused. This game's so confusing. Uh, how do I get back into the main building? I feel like maybe I need to get back into the main building, but I... Oh, I came out this way. So that's not going to work. There's like all this shit, like, allegedly that I haven't done in the motel with a safe and a Colt handgun and wire and 
Rusty ticket, Sky Tram Forest. It says nothing about being underground and having a fight with Matey Boy. I'm, I'm so confused. That walkthrough is completely walkthrough is completely different to what I'm doing here. I'm hungry. I think this is where I gave up, you know. This strikes me as... Somewhere where I would definitely give up. Pick up bottles. So it's just a bottle. Champagne, slowdowns, that doesn't open, there's no keys in there, it's like just a dead end, I'm so confused. Malay weapons everywhere, but it's a shovel. That's a sh rake. This is on. Nothing up here is there on a crate or anything. I'd forgotten how boring and confusing this game was, says Gavin. Uh which the walkthrough says Head through the door immediately to your right. This is a motel. Head through the door immediately to your right. Move into the room and then right, and to the right of the bed is a desk. Open the middle drawer for a power cord. Done that. Back in the main hall, go right and into the next room over. Open the drawer of the dresser at the foot of the bed for first aid kit. Got that. Move to the corner ahead and to the right where the window is. Use the power cord on the appliance here. Oh. Do I need to take the power cord back from here? No. Wait. Have I got a power cord still? Wait. Hold on. How do I open my inventory? Do I, do I have a power cord in my inventory? I thought I took it out and put it in... on the... No, I didn't, because I only turned that on. So do I still have the power cord? I can't fucking remember. This game's a nightmare. <laughs> Alright, so let's say I do have it, because... Oh, there we go. No. No, I don't have it. Okay, right, so I need to... F Makes no sense. Is this this is a motel, right? So I'm gonna head through the door immediately to your right. Okay. Move into the room and then right, and to the right of the bed is a desk.
What is it with what I don't Right, fuck you, IGN. You'll walk through shit. Okay, Silent Hill Downpour. Walk through. Not IGN's. Devil's Pit Stop. Proceed around a diner. Smash the blah blah blah. Smell gas. Otherworld diner. Done that. Once again, you'll find yourself in a diner. Go through the door to your right. You'll get into the diner's motel. Find a first aid kit in the WC. Head down the hallway. What? There's like a... There's like a whole bit I've skipped somehow. The... the Why is why it's like I've played a section of the game that isn't listed in any of the walkthroughs. Like the whole bit where you punch the guy downstairs isn't listed unless I'm being really Otherworld Diner. I've done the Otherworld Diner. Quickly turn the valve to stop the water rising. Done all that, yeah. So, power cord. So there was a puzzle, there was a motel safe somewhere, allegedly. And if you open the door, you will reveal a cult. Okay, I didn't do that. Head back to the kitchen on the first floor, go down to the basement. Okay, pick up the voyeur's notes, okay. Right, okay, into a screamer. Fight ahead, lift basement. Head to the lift in the basement, pass the stairs, use a piece of wire, okay. Step into Shack C, the first one on the right, to find some clothes on the bed for Murphy to change into. This is a fucking piece of shit. Okay. This is. Com Here we go. So these clothes. Ah, oh, thank fuck. Maybe this is all I needed to do. Nice. This is stressing me out. Now I've got the rusty t key. Finally. Jesus Christ. The fuck makes walkthroughs? If you need any walkthroughs, go to Eurogamer.net because at least they know how to structure their walkthroughs so they're readable. Ba, ba, ba. Okay, frame rated my way through there. And oh, a police badge found in the pocket of some discarded clothes. Alright, Jesus Christ, finally. No wonder I gave up on this game, it's annoying as fuck. Alright, heading back up the hill. Hey! Whoa! What the hell? Hey! No! Oh, you piss weasel. Get... Suck a dick. Okay. Pretty injured now. How do I... Oh, no. Use Mer Mer and open. Okay, now take it. it. Wherever this thing goes, can't be worse than back there, can it? I fucking hope not. Jesus Christ, that was a slog. 
Oh, that was not fun. It's just... I don't know. Bad... I just feel like that was badly designed. I know I had to search for clothes, but the mission to search for clothes happened such a long time ago that I'd almost forgotten I had to search for clothes. I'd been to the other world and been chased by beasts. You can probably go back to the diner and get the gun now, says Kara. Oh! Forgot about the gun, didn't I? Onward to the open world ish bit, says Bryson Robot. Fucking hell. Do I want to go onward? I didn't before. Poetic justice, if the crown trashes, then the game disc ejects and breaks as so spun off scene. <laughs> Alright, ah, here we go, more of this shit. Devil's Pit, entrance. Find a way into town. Have you really got an entrance sign pointing at an exit sign? That's just... Ah, 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 I don't, ah, I'm going to go this way, I can't, no entry, ah, the signage is confusing, just like the rest of this game, it's very confusing. Train conductor. Hello. Anybody in here? Yes. Oh, Hello. what's that? Pills? No, can't use the pills. Pick up chairs and things and bottles and some of the telly. Hello. We'll have some first aid. Thanks. I'm playing hard mode now because I don't have a gun. Wait, what is that? Use? What is it? Oh, was it saying use at the toilet? It was. Uh, wait, what's this bit for? What is this bit for in the house? I'm like a fuck's sake. Hello. Pick up. A lighter. That's down to equip, unequip the lighter and use it from your inventory. And what's that? That's a toolkit. Radio. DJ Ricks. Quite like the uh, photos of the uh, tool racks. Is that it? Isn't it? Much to oh. this down. You can break the door with an axe or, an or another metal weapon by pressing X. <laughs> oh, I guess this knife isn't made out of metal then. Here we go. <laughs> nice. Hello, it is me. Wait, what? Just a, what was that for then? Just to get a crowbar and listen to WKD FM. Hmm. Oh no! I'm trapped here! Shit. Well, at least I'm no more fugitive. What? Wait, what? <coughs> what can I... Was there, a, was there another door to smash down that I missed? Why did it... Oh! Oh! oh. oh. 
Okay, really had a little bit of a. Oh, here we go, look. Smashy, smashy. Smashy, smashy. Hi. Start, starting to get a little bit annoyed by the sneaky, sneaky door thing now because every single door you press square to go in. Oh no, you don't. You press like A to go in, and then instead of going in, you just stand there like that. And so far, there's been zero reason for me to even have the sneaky, sneaky, scary door. Ah, uh, here we go, here we go. Okay, hooray. Can I squidge past that? Am I going to get electrocuted? No. Nope. Seems dangerous. High voltage area, just being all high voltagey there, but there doesn't seem to be anything else to dab into there. Okay. Key must be going up here. Have a good, uh, got to go, peeps. Have a good evening, says Frank Renarts. Thank Frank. Thanks, Frank. Oh, wh why can't I run in this section? Very weird. Was that Nickelback? Was it really Nickelback? I don't really know Nickelback, so it could have been. Could explain why the game was flopped, so yeah. Okay. What else? Anything else here? Uh, lovely postcards, bit too dark. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's quite a uh, good little bit of detail on the postcards. You got the cable cars there. Information. Ooh. Pick up. Devil's Pit exterior. This is quite a big cave of tears. Too sure I like the sound of that, you know. Ooh, something's happening. Oh, goes goes down quite a long way. This game is made of butts, says Nightcat. Oh. Pretty impressive, ain't it? Oh, hello there, sir. You might not guess by looking at it, but this place used to be filled with all kinds of visitors. Moms and dads and little kids and... Yeah, it was a really nice place. I'm sorry. It... You are... Name's JP, and that, sir, is the Devil's Pit. 490 meters straight down to the blackest soul of the earth. JP's a the deepest creepy madman. Look, look, north that's of fascinating, but... <sighs> Sorry. Someone, something, tried to kill me back there. You haven't seen anyone? I'm strange. Wandering around here, have you? I mean, look in the mirror, buddy. First time visitor, huh? Yep. If there's a quick way out of here, I'd really appreciate it if you if you just tell me. Way out? What good would that do? Sorry, we uh don't get too many visitors these days. Right. Well, be seen. Uh, if you if you head through the cavern, there's a train. It can take you to Hillside. Boy, I tell you, all the kids they uh, just love that little train. How about cool. you show me? Sorry. A tree in the background. Some place there, I, I gotta be. Eight bit. Hmm. Thanks for the tip. Well. <laughs> the Devil's Pit. Sounds like a fun place to bring the family. It's only just picked up on a name that's called The Devil's Pit after we've been through uh, many different pits. 
different places called Devil's Pit, like the Devil's Pit Diner. Is it? I was hoping there'd be like a little jump scare or something when you look through it, but oh, I can zoom. Oh yeah, there we go. That's better. That's quite cool. That is a nice touch. Look even further to the left because I couldn't look very far to the left. Here we go. Something weird going to happen down here. Doesn't look like it, does it? Oh, yeah. Oh, what's that? Look. Oh, dear. That's not cool. How are you doing in there, Handy? Okay. Well, through the devil's pit. Spooky, nice. There we go. Down we go, even. So I guess we're heading now into the Devil's Pit cave system. Why have we got one of these? What's this one? S same map. Oh, we've got a lower underground bit. Okay, so I'm still there. Cave of Tears, train station. Why is that circled in red? That must be my destination. The train station. Thank you. Fun in the sun. Ah, that's cheerful. Okay. Meh. 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 Missing my gun already. What the? Fucking hell! Didn't give me a chance to. Oh! Take this, oil ladies. It just didn't give me a chance. Just lightning fast attacked me right on the back. Okay, nothing else in here. It was, it was nearly a monster closet. Bother to waste my money on any more sightseeing shenanigans. Ooh. That's a sh shrine to Arthur Dedden. Ooh. Ooh, don't fancy having a boulder hit me on the head, thanks. Bat's Lament Falls. The waterfall before you, the tallest in Devil's Pit, is called Bats Lament Falls. Okay, the weeping bats have known to be unpredictably aggressive. Oh, I'm more worried about this bloody bridge than I am the bats. Can I? Oh, okay. oh fucking hell, there is absolutely no way you'd get me on that bridge, Jesus. Yep. Yeah, well, that's, that'd be me dead. Who do you think I am, Nathan Drake? Oh, okay. Oh shit, come on. Oh. Oh, I see. Just takes a couple of seconds for the game to... What the... Do what you want it to do. Oh, 
go. He made it up. What a what a brave what a brave, strong, upper bodied man who can't fit through that gap. There we go. Oh, we've got a spooky door to uh, why can't I turn my have I thrown my where the fuck has my torch gone my torch fall down there I've lost my torch I've lost my crowbar brilliant Right, there are now two ways to go. One is that way. It looks like okay, so there's a looks like it's a dead end up here, but I'll just have a little double check. Gotta be another way down. Yes, it's a dead end. Okay. It fell off me. Ah uh, at least I have a rock. Ah, no, I'm going to have the pickaxe instead of the rock. Seriously telling me I don't get to have a flashlight in a mine. Perhaps one of the most darkest of locations. God, he's making a meal out of this, isn't he? Squeeze through. Still, still like getting in here somehow. We're not technically under. Oh, we are underground. What the hell is the light source? Oops. Threw my pickaxe on the floor. Hello. Ah. Here's the light source. It's a creepy cavern. There's a little squeezy hole there. Stairs there. The lift. Locked. So the underground river powers most of the mine's machinery. Hmm. Wow. Interesting. So do you think I've got to turn the river on? Oh my god, it's so dark I can't. Water shoot. There we go. Pumps elevator. Well, I guess we'll just have to turn it and see what happens. Pump has drained the cave, whatever that means. So it probably means the elevator's not on yet. But still. Because that would be too easy. Yeah, so I think maybe go through here now? We'll press up on the D-pad to use the lighter or something, says Lassa, so that might help. Okay, yeah. Kind of works, I mean... For some reason, matey... Bo can I? Oh yeah, he does, okay. I was going to say, for some reason, matey boy can't hold a lighter and an axe at the same time. But he doesn't throw it on the... Oh no... Oh 
Oh no. That's a body. Wait. Where the fuck am I going then? Oh. Oh no. So gloomy. What have we got here? A pick up. And A pick up. Pistol bullets. Oh. Oh. Glad I got that pistol. Shit! Oh, that's not how you run. There we go. Oh, fuck! Ah, oh, I got attacked by a homing woman. Well, that is an unpleasant scream. Okay. So was that all there was to get down here? Can't go that way. A proper dead end. There's definitely nothing through here, was there? Can I... Can't smash through that. Was looking at me weird. <laughs> uh, okay, well, I guess I need to move. Look, I've lit up the third light, so. I basically, I think if I move this, there we go. Got the elevator going, hopefully. That wasn't too hard. Maybe. Right, okay, that made more sense than any, literally any of the other puzzles in this game. <laughs> Whee! Going down again. Down in the depths of the Saratoga Mountains, um, near an aerial train station, tram station, somewhere underground. Wait, Overlook Penitentiary, is that where I came from? How did the bus get across the... Oh, I don't care. Um, right. Well, it is nine o'clock, so that is uh, that is it. That is um, that's enough teraflops for me today. Uh, Silent Hill downpour. It's just it's it's like a bit dull. It's not very scary. That first bit, like the, it just was. It just felt like it wasn't fun. There, like. Everything was confusing, and I didn't really. I don't know. There could have been. It could have been much easier signposting for the, the puzzles, and I don't know. Just maybe it was me being dumb. But yeah, I just did not. Like I had to consult the walkthroughs a couple of times because things just seemed a bit. Inexplicably tough to solve. I don't know if that's because the level design and the signposting was wrong or odd or because of me. I could imagine playing this game when it first came out and there was no 
walkthroughs, I could imagine myself being really frustrated and giving up at that point where I couldn't find the clothes. Uh, oh, look, she keeps getting up. Um, I could definitely imagine that's why I gave up. Hey, stop it, no! Uh, but there's parts, there's points in this game which are quite good. Like, I like the the up, the underworld, the other world bit, like the level design of the other world bit. Even though, like it it's like it looked like it stretched off a distance, like for a distance, and there was loads of different like cool, crazy bits of machinery. But in reality, it was actually just a few corridors with some very simple turn the thing puzzle in them. Uh, but visually, it looked nice. This is probably visually the best game I've played on Terraflop so far, but it does have some performance issues. Uh, and it's, I was going to say it, it's one of the only games that I've played so far that I'd actually be interested in continuing to play off stream or something, but there's so many other good games to play. I, I, I don't think I can... I don't think I could be asked. I've got like Final Fantasy VII Remake to play, I've got Hunt Down to play, I've got Warzone to play, I've got so much other, I've got better things to do with my time. But uh, it was quite fun uh, re rediscovering Silent Hill Downpour and seeing why it's the forgotten Silent Hill game. And the reason is it's just not very memorable and it's a bit dull. <laughs> For a, for a game from 2012, it's probably a little bit janky as well, but and it's nowhere near as good as the Japanese Silent Hills, that's for sure. But I can still see why Silent Hill fans and some people like it. There are some glimmers of hope there, which is uh, more than could be said for Hour of Victory. So yeah, thank you so much everybody for um, checking this game out. And thanks to Christian Niseke, who's who's just subscribed. High five. Uh, why play 6 out of 10 when you can have some 9, says Gavin. Indeed, indeed. Thanks for streams, says uh, Ian, says Offworld. Yes, and thank you so much everybody for watching it. I'll be back next Tuesday with another Terraflop. I've got loads of games to get through in this series. Um, I've done a an alright game. Like I've, got, I've done a... An, a disappointing game, I've done a terrible game, and I've done a kind of like a dull game. Next week I think I might do another terrible game, because I've got a lot of those. And I've got a terrible game in my pile that I haven't played, I've, I've played through once I think for the achievements, and I haven't played again since because it was fucking bobbins. And it's a game I never hear people talking about. Oh, I've earned one more. I've earned one more achievement. Seven, almost seven years since. Uh, but yeah, it's a game I never hear people talking about anymore. So it'll be interesting to see if anybody has any memories of it because I think it just came out, flopped, and no one ever spoke about it again. So I will give you um, a week to guess what that is. Uh, and in the meantime, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much to the mods for keeping everyone safe. Big thanks to everyone who's been uh, commenting and chatting and watching, even if you haven't been chatting. It's uh, great to see people watching and enjoying themselves. Um, I will be back tomorrow. What's tomorrow? Wednesday. Oh yes, I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to be doing the Animal Crossing Garbage Island Tours. I'm going to be back in Animal Crossing, picking up all your rubbish because I couldn't do it on Monday. So uh, I will hopefully see you then and see lots of other people's islands then um, at about 6pm tomorrow. Goodbye! <laughs>